Rafa is right on the border with Egypt, and that is where the vast majority of Gazans are now taking refuge. The inauguration ceremony of Liberia's new president, Joseph Boakai, has been cut short after he appeared almost to pass out from heat exhaustion during his speech. 79-year-old Mr. Boakai had been delivering his address for around 30 minutes, and it became clear he was having difficulty talking. Earlier, the new president said he wanted to rekindle hopes, adding that dignity in public service and respect for the rule of law must be restored. United Nations experts have urged the Sri Lankan authorities to immediately suspend a sweeping anti-narcotics drive that's affected tens of thousands of people. Sri Lanka began the crackdown last month and has arrested and questioned more than 40,000 alleged drug users and smugglers. With more details, here's Amber Asan Etiwajan. The experts said drug users had rights, and the campaign against suspected offenders was deeply worrying. They also urged the Sri Lankan authorities to investigate thoroughly and impartially any allegations of torture and ill-treatment. Critics say many of those arrested are from marginalized socio-economic groups. Most of them have been released on bail, while a few thousand have been sent to military run rehabilitation centers with the UN expert Colombo Sata. Lord Ram has arrived. 